So here, I guess, is my uh, first video I'm making. I've been working on this 1964 Ford Falcon wagon. And, uh, you kind of see it, but uh, I got it from a guy who got it out of a junkyard. He um, he uh, picked it up, and I bought it from him. He decided he didn't want to fix it, so it missing quite a few parts. You know. Gauge cluster was missing. Didn't have a hood on it when I got it. Miss motor was locked up. So on and so forth. You know, uh, you kind of see the, the car itself. Pretty cool car. Um, but sometime, probably in the 70s or 80s, somebody glued a carpet down. I don't know, you can see it right here. Kind of see it right there to the dash and. I was kind of curious what it was, and it um, it's actually hot glue. They used hot glue to glue that carpet down. Made a big mess of it. And <clears throat> so I was uh, wondering how you pull it off, and I, you know, was wondering what was what it was actually, and ended up figuring out that you know, yeah, it was hot glue. Take a little heat to it, just for a second. Yeah, you can know, see that. But uh, I pull, started pulling it off, so I'm gonna. I'm gonna clean it up and go from there. When it's uh, during the day, I'll have to make another video of uh, you know roll the car out and make a video of it. Just been been fixing her up. I uh, originally had a 200 in it, uh, two-speed automatic. I installed a uh, 250 and a C4 in it. Put a eight-inch out of a Maverick and the uh, steering linkage out of a Maverick. I'll have to show you that. So I'm working on modifying the steering column, but. Uh, yeah, oh, uh, yeah, here she is, so, cool. All right, so, I've been uh, working on it, and if you see over here, got a bunch of it off already. Um, well, this is what I was doing, so, it should be interesting one-handed, but, you just take the torch, and just heat it up. take the scraper and it just come right off which I thought was pretty cool I mean yeah it's gonna need some cleanup uh, there's still hot glue on there and I found if you just heat it up a little bit more you can scrape most of it off but uh, yeah so it looks like hopefully I can uh, get this cleaned up next couple of nights and throw a coat of paint on her this next week all right so I was able to get most of the glue off. I don't know if you can see, you know, most of the uh, carpet and glue is off, but it looks like, and this is with just a scotch bright pad, I'm going to probably end up taking it down to bare steel for the most part just to get that uh, glue all the way off, which is okay. I mean, I wasn't, I'm not too concerned about that. Uh, I figured I'd probably have to anyways. I'm going to paint the dash, just some rattle cans because this is a uh, this whole car is being put together on the cheap, so, but yeah, you know, just uh, figured I'd show you that I was able to get it off, and uh, just keep going from there, and hopefully in the next part of this video, it'll have a nice cleaned up dash, and then painted in the next couple of days, so we'll go to there. Well, here we have it. I got the uh, dash all painted up all pretty. Uh, not too long ago, windshields in, you know, you know, uh, that was not the easiest thing to do, didn't make a video of it, but wasn't too bad, we, uh, found a, uh, 65 in the junkyard here, oh, a couple months back, I was able to pull the, uh, you see, you see it very well, but there's wiring harnesses out of a 65. The wiring harness in this car was hacked to bits. And because I got the 65 wiring harness, it happened to have the yeah, two, two spots, the two speed wipers, which I thought was cool. Didn't have a headlight switch, didn't have the wiper switch, so I was pretty happy to pick those up. Got, you know, my key. I bought those from falconparts.com, this guy right here. Um, wasn't too bad. 
guy I know gave me this Mercury radio, which is pretty cool. I figured I might as well just throw it in. Um, yeah, so I, I think that my paint job came out pretty well overall, you know, um, just cleaning it up, working on it. This paint's just a cheap paint from Walmart. Uh, you can buy a can of it for like buck fifty. I mean, see right there, some primer and some uh, the paint, home shades or something like that. So yeah, you know, just coming along real nicely, and you, you can't even tell any of that carpet was on the dash, which is what I was going for. Uh, other good news, look right where I'm sitting. Uh, you can see it. I got a bench in there. That's actual. That's out of that 65 Falcon we found at the junkyard. Um, I was pretty excited about that. Yeah, it's still a little tore up, but I didn't have a bench seat.